Hello everyone, we hope you all are doing well. Welcome to another fan to play fantasy match preview. This is for the game between the Sixers and the Strikers and we have Nikhil Bhai with us today to give you his insights and a new or a new venue what he expects as well as a new base team based on that. Yes, thank you so much for having me. Uh, trying to cope up with BBL and SAT20 while we go along. Uh thoda samajh nahi aa raha hai thoda sil ke upar se ja raha hai but again enough hints ke form se masti nahi and that is what we will continue to do uh kyunki wo apne hath mein jo apne hath mein uske bare mein tension uske bare mein we can control to baaki sab ke bare mein sochenge nahi new venue i still think ke last games to last year hue the to thoda thoda assumption ke base pe hoga ke bhai thodi movement hogi shuruaat mein and finish should get better to back and we will keep batting standards we know so yes bowlers and all rounders again it will be but again i am i won't be surprised if it turns out to be a very batting beauty jaise pots coaches or stars ke beech mein hui thi match jahan pe everybody was scoring mm. so <clears throat> very keen to see how the conditions are on the day yes absolutely new 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 venue new conditions so will be important to see what information you get pre game so let's hear more yeah. on that part so venue conditions and like we discussed first up the things you can expect here we have seen like nikhil bhai mentioned some moment up front but we have also seen that across the two games that have happened here last year and the year mm-hmm. before that there was some help for spin the guys who took wickets were some of the spinners who were amongst that so maybe that is something for you to watch out for and especially because we know how bbl batters even where the situation doesn't warrant they go and play a rash shot and it's very much possible that that happens to spin too and another thing that you should watch out for we have not been able to get a graphic of that is the when uh, is the ground dimensions because if it's really short then that can play a big part too because like nikhil bhai mentioned again at junction oval we saw a lot of runs scored and while the batting p- the pitch in itself was flat there was also very very short ground dimensions the same happened at albury too both the grounds where only one one game has happened and they are known more as local grounds this comes under that category so just keep an eye out on that nikhil bhai any other thoughts in terms of what you expect here yes i'm just opening trying to open the scorecard of the last game that happened here because it happened between these two sides only hmm. so just give me a minute while the technology loads itself and uh, i can give you an idea that what happened the last time these two sides met at the very same venue sydney sixers and adelaide strikers philippi scored 83 hmm. and lloyd Pope took two wickets so strikers batted first my favorite jonathan well scored 40 odd and uh, alex carey scored a 31 ball 29 to get 176 sydney sixers chased it down with joshua philippi scoring 83 of 52 again sidel and rashid took one and one to to again no, no, nothing much to read but रन्स बनते हैं जैसे हमने कहा था शुरुआत में थोड़ी प्रॉब्लम होती है बिकॉज द नेक्स्ट गेम और द गेम प्रीवियस टू दैट सिक्सर्स बैटेड फर्स्ट स्कोर 151 डैन क्रिस्टियन स्कोर वाओ जॉर्ज फिलिपी स्कोर 32 एंड अगेन एज ही सेड विकेट्स टू एस्टन एगर एंड पीटर अर्जो ब्लू दो 2 एंड 1 ओनली एंड देन स्कॉचर्स ऑफ कोर्स चेज इट डाउन थैंक्स टू एस्टन टर्नर हु इज तो इनफ साइंस के जो फॉर्म प्लेयर हैं उन्हीं पे बैक करो बिकॉज़ दे विल बी एबल टू अडॉप्ट तो it should be in that range only 150 to 170 and baki to we can only guess yes absolutely and the common thread that you saw there is both the keepers did score so let's see if our base team has both of them or not so yes first up the base team and uh, carries due for a knock he's played a decent one here last time around josh philip he had two decent knocks so no reason for you to leave either of them in terms of negative matchups we don't see too many again for both so hence they become good picks and in the batting we have gone with two batsmen in adam hose and steven smith now like you know chris lin uh, i am not too sure if he's going to play or not going to play here but uh, steve o'keefe is going to trouble him is not not available right no no lin is not available okay so yeah he's gone to the ilt20 not available and vince you already know is not available Moses on the kids it's your best best guess on which day you want to pick him so for now we have gone with the two guys who have scored the runs in Hoes and in Steven Smith Nikhil bhai any other thoughts because all the other batsmen that you see are local players and there no one shown con- signs of consistency yet 
Yes, just one thing to add there, uh, purely from a very small sample size. Josh Philippi first innings average is 14 in from so not much score in two games that is played batting first. Hmm. But in changes, he has averaging 43. Very small sample size. Two games while batting first, two seven games while batting second, average is 43. So maybe it is clear to Philippi ko while batting first, Jesse Abnaka swing hogi shuru me thodi. So wahan pe aap wait must be licking his lips. And if they take the catch, so there are too many. If 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 yes. with BBL, but uh, again, they possible risk grand league. Kill it. I said, I said, if you want to do it, you can do it. Moises, I feel, is long due, but he's finding ways to get himself out. Or yeah, I said, if you want to grand league, pick up. I will say, Jordan Sill, uh, because I feel when when no one is playing, Sill is playing, and he's done that for years. So if Smith and everybody don't don't come off, I think Silk is the guy who can give you a very good uh, 45-50. So if you see, I always have the likings for such guys, be it Jonathan Wells or uh, guys like Adam Moores or even uh, Silk here. Right, absolutely. And looks like the select percent is also with Nikhil Bhai. 73% people have him in their team yet. So they're rewarding the form that he's shown. In the all-rounders, we have gone with Sean Abbott, Matt Short, Hayden Kerr, and Travis Head, surprisingly, Travis Head looks like the differential for now, but that's purely <laughs> because he had a low score in the first one. I'm sure by the time the deadline arrives, more people will have him in. You also have the golden man, Dan Christian, who's had a good knock here and he bowled one over to sub in. Now, one key point for you to keep in mind is if you feel like Alex Carey, Travis Head will have a day out, and if Steve O'Keefe is going to bear the brunt of that, then Dan Christian is going to come and bowl. So, just yeah. think about that point one. And the second point to think about is Ben Maneti is an ex Sixers guy. And don't be surprised if he's used in the middle order against Patterson and Moses. So these are two things that can come into consideration. And in the bowling, we have gone with West, Ben Dwashes, and Henry Thornton, assuming he plays because Peter Siddle is not in the squad. And Nikhil Bhai, what do you think about this matchup? Because if he had and carry settle in, It'll mean two things. It can mean Stephen O'Keefe gets a cut and it'll also mean that Nathan Lyon gets a full day out because he didn't in the last one. Yes, fair call. And one thing that I have to do with the current crop of test guys who have come in. Aap dekho to, apart from Smith, I, hmm. nobody else has looked like you know, in absolute top rhythm. Uh, be it hmm. Khwaja as well. They've had one few malab, Gandhi bowling ko put away karehi, utna to class hai usme. उन सभी में पर टेस्टिंग में ऐसा आपको जैसा लग नहीं रहा है कि भाई दिल कम थ्रू वेरी नाइसली कैरे आल्सो हैड एन ऑफ गेम मे बी दिस इज द फर्स्ट गेम दैट दे से वी डिस्कस इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो दैट आर गेटिंग यूज्ड टू द टेंपो ऑफ द लीग व्हिच इज डिफिकल्ट टू मैच बिकॉज़ दे परफॉर्म मच हायर एंड द लीग इज वेरी इट इज तो नो 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 डिसरिस्पेक्ट टू एनीवन बट इट्स हाउ इट इज यू हैव टू अडॉप्ट टू द लेवल एंड गेट यूज्ड टू द कंडीशंस वेरी क्विकली तो वहां से इट इज वेरी ट्रिकी क्योंकि पिछले गेम में भी अगर आप देखें तो जो हीट वाली गेम थी एवरीबडी हैड बैजली नेसो लाबुशैन नॉट मेनी पीपल हैड रेंचो बट रेंचो वाज प्लेइंग बीबीएल ही वेंट ऑफ केम बैक बट स्टिल गॉट गोइंग बिकॉज़ ही वाज पार्ट ऑफ द लीग ऑलरेडी तो अडॉप्ट हां एंड उसको अडॉप्ट करने को प्रॉब्लम नहीं हुआ इतना तो मे बी आई डोंट नो मे बी आई एम रीडिंग टू मच इनटू इट बट इट इज अ पॉसिबिलिटी कि अगर आपको रिस्क लेना है तो वैसा ले लो जैसे सर ने बोला एक्स प्लेयर है दोनों को निकाल लेंगे ऊपर ही तो काम हो सकता है एंड द टेस्ट प्लेयर कैन आल्सो डू दैट तो प्लेंटी ऑफ ऑप्शंस फॉर यू टू ट्राई आउट देयर यस एब्सोल्युटली प्लेंटी ऑफ ऑप्शंस फॉर यू टू ट्राई आउट लेट्स टेल अस लेट्स टेल यू हु आर द फ्यू ऑप्शंस दैट वी आर गोइंग टू ट्राई आउट इन दिस वन तो निखिल भाई हुआ यू गोइंग टू ट्राई आउट Yes, yes. I think just to say, Mini Jail Zone, because he mentioned that it is very important in BBL. If you are working in BBL or if you have you know everything about them, then please play small league. Otherwise, if you are not doing anything about them, that is the line that I am going to keep saying. So yes, coming to Grand League options, I have told you first in Jordan Sill. Because I feel if there is help for Pacers and if there are new wickets from the new ball, So I think he is somebody who can always steady the ship for you. So वो एक वैसा आपका you know the game gets solved that way. From the other hand, I'm very tempted to take uh, Adam Moles for a similar role. 
पर अगेन द फाइनल कॉल माइट पॉसिबली बिटवीन टू बोलर्स इफ द कंडीशन लाइक पिच पे ग्रास है या नकल लग रहा है कि नहीं बॉलिंग में ज्यादा फायदा होगा बट अभी के लिए आई फील इट इट माइट बी द टू मिडल ओवर बैटर्स बाकी तो लेट्स सी एट द टाइम ऑफ द टॉस यस निखिल वाइस कैप्टन फॉर टुमारो एडम होस वाइस कैप्टन Jordan Silk, watch out for that, and watch us stay away from his team tomorrow. Cause they're gonna watch you away if both of those guys bat well. My two picks for tomorrow from the strikers, Alex Carey, and I'll I'll even call him a vice captaincy candidate. I think he can do well, and if the strikers lose that early wicket here and there, which I am expecting them to against Washes, I think he'll get some time to settle in and play a good knock. So that is my first pick. and uh, second pick is nikhil boy's favorite dan christian because i'm expecting one of the spinners also ha- to have an off day tomorrow which means he should get one or two overs and some batting so alex carey uh, grand league pick as vice captaincy candidate because he's probably going to be in everyone's team and dan christian just as a pick because he's probably not going to be in most people's team so, Achha, so just just to explain there i'll tell you why the logic of silk and again like you if you saw the telegram post that i did for the game between uh, stars and heat today i had larkin in all my teams hmm. again purely for the same role ke bhai wicket jayenge to he'll be able to score ab main unko vice captain option nahi dekh raha par agar aap small league bhi khel rahe ho and if you feel that cartwright may not work or hmm. the uh, brown may not work or khwaja may fall early then this guys become a very handy question for you ke bahut kam log unko leke aayenge फिर वहां पे अगर वो 25 30 भी स्कोर करता है एंड दीज आर द गाइस हु आल्सो टेक अ फ्यू हैंडी कैचेस तो एंड सिल्क तो यू यू इट इज ही इज नोन फॉर लाइक टेकिंग 3 4 कैचेस इन अ गेम सो दैट इज हाउ टैक्टिकली यू हैव टू स्टार्ट लुकिंग एट सच ऑप्शंस बिकॉज़ दे कुड इजीली नॉट गेट टू बैट एंड दे विल फील लाइक अ वेस्ट तो यूज देम इन योर विजुलाइजेशन कि अगर आप विजुलाइज ऐसा कर रहे हो तो ही उन्हें लो नहीं तो फिर इट विल जस्ट ऑक्यूपाई स्पॉट तो कैप्टन वाइस कैप्टन तो मैं मुझे नहीं लगता मैं उनको बनाऊंगा पर दे आर अ वेरी गुड पीपल टू ट्राई आउट इन अ वेरी पर्टिकुलर सिनेरियो यस वेरी स्मार्टली ही हैज क्लैरिफाइड इट फॉर यू अदरवाइज देयर वुड बी अ रैंट ऑफ यूजलेस कमेंट्स बिलो दिस वीडियो टुमारो बट एनीवे यू टू टेल अस इन द कमेंट्स हु योर ग्रैंड लीग पिक्स फॉर दिस वन आर एंड हैव अ ग्रेट गेम ऑल द गुड लक टू यू एंड सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट वन चेस हैव